It's not often a wetter workshop opens its inner doors, especially to journalists, but one of their surprise hits, Rise of the Planet of the Apes, is being released on Blu-ray, and they wanted to show off the technology that made it such a success. Our own David Farrier was invited inside to learn how to be a monkey. After a terrible Tim Burton remake, the Planet of the Apes franchise was meant to die. Where am I? What is this place? Then this year, this film came along. Oh, he's a smart one, isn't he? Audiences and critics loved it, and it all came down to believable, lovable apes. The chimps and monkeys and gorillas were all created by Weta, which is why I'm here strapping on a motion capture suit. Forget this is here. Okay. Just perform through the suit, through all the technology. I am yeah. a monkey. Yeah, yeah, all right. yeah. Andy Serkis wore this gear to play this chimp, Caesar. Critics said he outacted main star James Franco. After being covered in dots, your body is calibrated for the infrared cameras. Then, with the help of arm extensions, it's time to walk like a monkey. What do you need to do to be a good monkey? Watch lots of reference footage. We were on YouTube a lot. Now, during this scene in the film, the Golden Gate Bridge is all computer generated, as are the apes. It was my task to become the main chimp, Caesar. Caesar! It's all rendered on the fly. <laughs> it's hard to take yourself seriously when you look and act like this. I couldn't even get the noises right. <laughs> My trainers had practiced for months just to be monkeys in the back of shot. It's a good, eh? They know what they're doing. Yeah, they're professionals. Yeah, they are. Before I left Weta, I thought it best to get a tip from the pro. I put the mocap suit on yesterday for the first time. Uh, it's quite tight and you feel it's, you almost feel nude in that thing. Do you have any tips for, I guess, getting past that and, and for getting always the Always put a pair gear? of socks down the front of your trousers. It always does wonders. Rise of the Planet of the Apes has already grossed $600 million so far. No doubt the Blu-ray will add to that, not to mention the fact they've greenlit a sequel. David Farrier, 3 News.